Hey everyone, so today we're going to be doing a current beauty slash one fashion favorite but pretty much just beauty favorites today and these products are bomb and I could just not not show you guys. Um, I need to share these products with you guys. They're amazing and I'm so excited. Before we get started, make sure you like this video so I know what kind of content you guys like. Make sure you guys leave any recommendations down below. I have all my socials and these products linked in the description box. And let's just get started. I'm just going to get the first little fashion item out of the way. Um, I've been loving pearls and I've been using pearl earrings for the longest time, but I've kind of just not rediscovered them. Um, I was more into like little studs and things like that, but I've gotten back into the little pearls and I do want to get my third piercing so then I could wear all three. I'm only wearing um, one right now, but um, earlier this week I was wearing um, two because I have two holes, but these are amazing. I got these from Shein, I believe, or one of those sites. I'm not really sure, but you can find pearls anywhere. And they're just a nice little fashion statement. I have three lip products. So the first one is the Becca Lipstick in the shade Yours Truly. I'm wearing it today with a gloss on top. But it is such a beautiful, beautiful, nudie pink mauve shade. And I just love it so much. I've had this for a little bit now. And I kind of just rediscovered it maybe a few months back. And let me tell you, it is such a beautiful, perfect nude. I do love my KKW lipstick. I, I will always love it, but this is a little more pink. So when I want more of a pinky nude, I go for this one. And it's just amazing. This lipstick isn't matte or um, like creamy, I guess you could say. It's more of a satin finish. Um, so it's not going to dry your lips, nor is it going to make it look very shiny unless you add a gloss on top. The next item is the gloss that I'm wearing today and it is the Ciate London Watermelon Burst Hydrating Lip Oil. So it is so cute. I have the mini size because I got it in my Ipsy bag and as you can tell I've been loving this. Um, I even wear this to bed sometimes because it is so hydrating. It's a lip oil so you know I love my lip oils. I love my Ulta ones as well. Those are $9. I think the full size of this is 16 which isn't bad whatsoever. And it literally smells so delicious. It smells like a Starburst or something like that. It's just awesome. And as you can see, my lips look so like glassy. Um, I did order the full size and it's coming next week, I think. So stay tuned for my Sephora haul, but this is a killer lip oil. If you watched my e.l.f. cosmetics haul or my testing a full face of e.l.f. cosmetics, um, you would have seen this e.l.f. ride or die lip balm in the, um, it's not, I guess scent, I think it's scent, um, in Mighty Mint and honestly, just look at the packaging and think of who they kind of replicated. I love Glossier, don't get me wrong, but this is a lot cheaper and it is just as good, maybe even better. Um, so I would recommend getting these. I'm going to buy the tinted ones. Um, they were sold out when I wanted to purchase them. So I purchased this and this is perfect as of right now. Um, but I want some tinted ones just for when I'm outside in the sun, whatever. Or I just want a little bit of tint to my lips. But this has such a thick, nice formula. It is totally, totally, totally a dupe for their, um, little lip set as well. The last makeup item is the e.l.f. Cosmetics Little Bite Size Duo and this is in White Peach I believe. So the highlight is pretty good but the thing that I mostly use is the blush. The blush is stunning. I have it on today as you could tell. It is just a pretty peach color. So pigmented so you need a light hand but this is I think two or three dollars so it is a total steal. It's so tiny, so it's perfect to take with you when you travel and things like that. Um, I want to buy more shades. They have a bunch of different shades for all different types of skin tones. So really go check this out. It's um, If you want to see me apply it, I it's in my e.l.f. Testing a full face of e.l.f. Cosmetics. So go check that out. I'll link it down below. But this, please just go pick this up. 
I don't think it's in the stores, but it is online. I do have a set of lashes, and these are the Anastasia Beverly Hills lashes in the style fashion. So this is what they look like. They are so, so beautiful on the eyes. They're very, like, fluffy. Um, they're very full. I mean, they're not very full, but they're very even on all sides, so it just kind of goes like that, if you know what I mean. And um, they're on sale as of right now. Hopefully they still are once this video is up. Um, but still, they're I think they're $18 and they're on sale right now for $6. So no matter what, they're still pretty inexpensive. And I've used these in a couple of tutorials already. Um, and these are bomb. They look so beautiful and they look like eyelash extensions. Next up is the Milani Make It Last. It took me so, so long to hop on this bandwagon, but it is totally worth it. I do love my Morphe setting spray, don't get me wrong. That kind of just melts all my makeup together and makes it look really flawless, but this actually makes my makeup last. And you know, we have to be wearing masks and things like that. Um, I work um, and I have my mask on for eight plus hours, so I need something to, you know, hold everything in. Um, I work at a hair salon, so, you know, I want to have my makeup done. Otherwise, I probably wouldn't, you know, whatever. But um, this Milani Make It Last has made my makeup stay all day, even wearing a mask. Last but definitely not least is the Grande Lash MD Lash Enhancing Serum. So everything that I've showed you today is very affordable, except for this. I think this is $65, and you're probably thinking, what the heck, Julie? Why are you telling me to buy a $65 lash serum? Well, let me tell you, I've had this for a while now. Um, I think I posted a haul with this in it. I'm not really sure it would be an Ulta haul. Um, I have a few of those on my channel, but I've seen a lot of TikToks on this as well. Um, and they say that, you know, this little bottle is supposed to last you three months, which is nice, but people say it lasts them even longer. And this is amazing. You can't really tell how long my lashes are right now because I'm wearing a natural brown mascara. But I'm going to do a close-up and you're going to see how long they are and they just look stunning. I've gotten so many compliments on them and I just am really focusing on my skin, making it look as good as possible, making my lashes look as good as possible and my eyebrows as naturally as possible, just trying to enhance everything um, and just to make me feel nicer and more beautiful um, and this really helps out with all of that. So that was everything in today's video. I hope you guys enjoyed. All these products are pretty much affordable except for the last serum, but all of these items are so totally worth it. And remember, I'll have everything linked down below. I'll have all my socials linked down below. And if you have any recommendations, just leave them in the comments and I will probably film it. So just let me know. And thank you so much for watching and I'll see you in the next video. Bye.